In this video I'm going to show you how to change the font colors of your panels in Ubuntu. First thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, just change the color of my panel. So I'll right click on my panel, go to properties, go to the tab background, I'll set it as a solid color. You can choose the color of your panel if you didn't know. You can set it to any color you'd like. I'm just going to leave it out for now and make my panel transparent. I will do the same with the bottom panel. Right click once again, go to properties, go to background, set it as solid color and just make it transparent. Okay, so as you can see now the background is shining through the panels which is quite nice. But let's say you have a really dark background and if the font is black you won't really be able to read it so I'm already struggling to read mine with this background I have on now so I found a nice program called um, GNOME color chooser in synaptic package manager so I'm going to show you how to get that quickly uh, just go to system go to administration open up synaptic package manager when they click in the search box just type in GNOME dash color dash chooser it will pop up when you search it um, if you don't just scroll down and look for it uh, right click on it mark for installation I already have it installed so I'm not going to do that part again so just mark install and and once you did that just click apply wait for the changes to be applied once that is done you can just close it down so when you've done that just go back to system preferences and if you go down you'll find gnome color chooser so now you open that up once it open um, this is a very handy tool to have you can change a lot of colors of a lot of different things in here so you can play around with it see what what you can change but for now I'm just gonna change my panels so I would go to the tab panel and the font color um, for the panel is this first one, the foreground, the normal one. So just tick off that box, go and choose your color you want. I'm going to stick with white. So I'm going to make it white and I want to change the font. If you go down, check the font box, click on it and just go choose the font you'd like. I'm just going to stay with that one for now, but I want it bold and I will stay with the size 10. So I'll say OK and I would apply. And now if you'll see now you'll see the difference. It stands out a lot more and it's a lot more personal, more unique. So you can just play around and see how you like it. So um, thank you for watching and please comment. If you have any questions, please ask any request you want me to do. I'll do my best to help and thank you again for watching